Hey, I heard that you are working on visible spectrum imaging system. What it is exactly? These imaging systems are made to take images from an elevated position. This can be mounted on a ground or airless vehicles and an interface with a given vehicle's communication system. Mm, do you think it is useful? Oh yeah, why not? Aerial imaging is being in practice from 1858 and was mainly used for military purposes from the time of World War I. Now these days, aerial imaging is not only used in movies production, but airborne surveys are used in the areas of mineral exploration, geological mapping, petroleum exploration, environmental studies, investigations for vegetation, wetlands, coastal surveys, etc. For technical companies like SIII, Fargo, Blue Sky, and ITT Space are working in this field. Uh, how it is different from ground imaging system? Oh, it is very different and very challenging. Aerial photographs are often taken at an angle to the object as the vehicle is always in the motion. This means that the images have to be taken at the proper dynamic and at the proper angle. These multiple aerial images have to be mapped with the real world objects. So converting these multiple photographs and deriving the real image is very challenging. Aerial imaging sounds interesting. Do you think there is scope for engineers like electrical engineer, mechanical engineering um, in developing such systems? Well, as I mentioned earlier, the camera continuously captures images of the objects in the ground will be mounted on the vehicle which is moving. However, the vibration in the vehicle introduces unwanted noise in the captured images. Mechanical skills are not only required to mount these camera and accessories but also to isolate the system from the noises. Computer engineering skills are needed to design the microcontrollers to communicate between the vehicle and the camera systems and to control the camera operations. Electrical skills are required to design the DAC for the power supply, target locking, sensor and calibration systems. Engineering skills are required to determine the image capturing position with respect to the altitude, speed and angle of the vehicle. Moreover, the biggest challenge to all concerned engineers is to minimize the weight and the size of the overall system in order to meet the design specifications of the unmanned air vehicles team. Oh wow, it looks like there are many opportunities for the engineers in this field.